Hello guys, Cody 280 here. Welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. And the last time we went back through the mines and uh we stopped Ragnarok's uh drill and this episode we will I don't know if this is the I don't know if this is the end of the st end of story mode. I really don't know what this is, but we're gonna go and do the final trial. I'm gonna go. I'm going in blind. I have no idea what I'm doing. I just hope that th now that I have all the killing, all the forbidden curses, this will go a lot smoother. Sebastian killed his uncle so I gotta uh, I gotta talk to Sebastian turn him in turn him not don't turn him in I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with that I gotta go down and there should be a cave somewhere. Slow down now. There we go. You can't imagine. You're here. I have good news. We do not have any of Ranrock's loyalists to contend with. Of course. The bad It's likely because they no longer need to track the key to the information. This place could do with a bit of pruning. Let's look around. Bombardo. Revelio. <sighs> is that a... It is. I believe I know what must be done. Do you recognize the head sculpted there? It looks like a grap horn. And the prints carved into the ground lead me to believe that a grap horn will somehow open the way forward. That's what Professor Rackham meant when he spoke of my needing an ability to interact with beasts. It would seem so. I do know that the last of a long dynasty of the grap horns lives nearby. They call him the Lord of the Shore. I suspect you'll need to bring him here. What happens next, I can't say. If that's what must be done, I'll do it. Excellent. I know this area well enough. When you see the remains of a large sea creature, you're in the right place. Now, Professor Rackham made it clear that you must engage with any beast that is part of this trial on your own. So I shall wish you good luck and wait for your return in the map chamber. All right, let's see what's going on now. I got way over there.
I have no idea what I gotta do for this final test. is completely useless about oh no I can't use any curses oh man attack Poacher. I need your I ain't gonna kill him. I will tame all the beasts.
Charge into battle. Let's see how the Lord for sure feels about his neighborhood being invaded. <laughs> I like this. I like this. It's fun. We're crossing that bridge, whether you like it or not. Son that saved Treadwell. Very lucky they've got protection. You regret this for the rest of your short life. Time for you all to clear out. Is it really this easy? This is the final trial? Perhaps Professor Rockham was right to have had faith in you. I still have my reservations. Isadora, as you will see, was not who she seemed. I can only hope that you are. My memories should answer any questions you may have about the power you will need to protect. Thank you, Professor Bakar. I shall see you back in the map chamber. Yeah. 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 Rebellion. Where is it? There's always a thing in here.
Hello? Is it Ora? Is it Ora? What did she do? Son, I'm glad you're here. Isadora was not at her home. I know. Her father. Oh, first of all. What is it? It is as though he was stripped not only of his pain, but of all emotion. Everything is much worse than I feared. Meep was right. Isadora hasn't stopped. I've just learned that she has been wielding that magic on students. We must gather the others. to your common room, all right? Just taking Don't her father's suffer. pain. She's taking everybody's Any pain. Longer. She's a dark wizard. Not my father. Not my students. No one. I can't always knew that. Isadora. But I didn't think she'll go this far. Set down your wand. Professor, you taught me to hone my power, not throw it away. I did not teach you this. Expelliarmus! <laughs> versus one, who's gonna win? He used the killing curse. He used the killing curse to get rid of get rid of her.
The caverns below Hogwarts, where you fought Isadora. Is that the location of the final repository? It is. You see, we could not destroy the strands of emotion Isadora had stolen from so many. So we did all that we could to keep them safe. We also realized that until they could be destroyed, the magic used to create them was a danger to wizard kind. Hence, we became keepers. Keepers of an unfathomable secret. We knew that someday, one with the ability to see traces of ancient magic might be seduced by its power. We built the trials to lead that person to us. To allow them to prove themselves worthy of the knowledge we'd kept hidden and the responsibility that accompanies it. Have I not proven myself, Professor? I need to get to that repository before Ranrock does. You have, and you will. But the repository is protected by powerful ancient magic. To enter, you must craft a special wand from the four artifacts you found above our pensives. So the repository is safe from Ranrock for now. If he is, as you suspect, capable of using the power of the other repository, I fear he will be able to breach our defenses. And I must go now and craft this wand. Perhaps Mr. Ollivander will help me. Another Ollivander? I'm not surprised. As I am sure he will tell you, this wand may be used for only one purpose. Return with the wand, and we will open the way forward. I shall send an owl ahead to Ollivander. Whilst you visit him, I'll reach out to Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley? Yes. I may have made an error in judgment by not informing her of Ranrock's intentions earlier. I only hope it's not too late. If Ranrock really is going to try to drill below Hogwarts, we'll need all the help we can get. All right, Professor. I'll see you soon. Just gonna take a shortcut. Field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. There's Ollivanders. Oh. I hope he can help me craft the Keeper's Wand. Hello, Mr. Ollivander. I wondered if you might be able to help me with something. Yes. Professor Fig sent an owl informing me that you'd be coming. He was a bit cryptic. Said you need to have a special wand crafted. That you'd bring me the materials. Yes, sir. I have them here. Oh, my. How extraordinary. 
remarkable design. I will be honest, I have never crafted a wand in this fashion. Repaired broken wands, of course, but this is something else entirely. Keeping me on my toes, aren't you? I think I can work with what you've brought me. Let me see what I can do. What are we what are we looking at, old man? It is done. I should warn you, I've never seen a one like this before. My suspicion, as Professor Fig implied in his letter, is that it serves a unique purpose. I doubt you shall find much use for it otherwise. I understand. Thank you, sir. I'm afraid you're on your own. I've ensured that we have a moment to ourselves. Oh, come, come. No need for such theatrics. In life, I guess my curse I have to fight Victor, and my curses ain't gonna work on you either. Our interests will never be aligned. You would let goblins take what is rightfully ours? The final repository belongs to wizard kind. We would be fools not to work together. What's that you've got there? Might this sudden visit to the wand maker have something to do with our mutual pursuit? I have no idea what you're talking about. That repository is my birthright! Charles Rookwood wouldn't have wanted you near it. <laughs> the arrogance. Should have known better than to try and reason with a child. I've always said children should be seen and not heard. Please tell me I get to I get to fight Victor. Uh... 
thing. We take them. You can't do a forever. Can bring them. You'll need to be quicker than that. Never. Ooh, Victor Breckford. So he is taking damage. Rain is finally over. I'll need to send an Alta Natty right away. For now, though, I need to get back to the map chamber and tell Fig what happened. Chamber after kicking Victor's butt. Take that. Too bad I quit Vala Cadabro. me as I left Ollivanders with the Keeper's Wand. I had to defend myself. Godric's heart, are you alright? I know you're well able to defend yourself. I've seen it often enough. But Rookwood himself... He would have killed me once he found the repository, if not before. I had no choice. You're right. 
You had no choice. You did what you had to do. The wizarding community owes you a great debt. Thank you for saying so, Professor. I'm ready for what's next. All right, then. The Keepers have been waiting. You have completed all of our trials, and you have done so under circumstances even I did not foresee. You understand now why all of this was necessary. The port key, the vault, the locket, the book, the trials. To ensure that one with the ability you and I share would make the same choice that San, Neve, Charles, and I did. Now that you have witnessed my memory, you understand all that is at stake. Not everyone is what they seem. As you know, light does not exist without shadow, nor shadow without light. Simply because you can eliminate darkness does not always mean that you should. Even the most well-meaning and competent amongst us cannot possibly know the consequences of manipulating what should be beyond our reach. What lies in the repository must never be released. Resist the temptation to destroy or control it. The magic that you have so carefully honed must now be used only to protect the secret we keep. You have the wand. You will know when to wield it. We leave our legacy in your hands. I should hope that the enchantments protecting the castle would protect against an incursion from below. I fear they may not. Although, if damn, the goblins. Let's be go. able to reach Professor Weasley. If his loyalists are here, he cannot be far behind. You and I have faced worse, Professor. I think this is a finale where we have to stop. I think I gotta stop the main goblin. I think this is the end. Let's go. The 
it's supposed to be the end of story mode. This is where I get to choose to be good or evil. You work for me. Wait, which one? What? Which one works for me? I don't know anymore. to finding the repository. I fear you're right, Professor. There's nothing we can do for our searching. Listen, more goblins up ahead. Good. I kick more butt. But yep, I have a feeling this is the... I have a feeling this is the end of story mode. A Monocadabra! Cause we, we, just, we defeated Victor, so now we gotta go after his boss. <laughs> These tunnels haven't brought us much luck so far. We're getting closer, Professor. That way. Somehow evaded the castle's defensive charms. Get them this way! We shall make quick work of them! I only know this is the end of the game because I spoiled myself by watching the end, of the end, so this is the final chapter. This is probably the last episode for story mode. Thank you. Quick. 
course, more minions. Yeah, this is this is definitely the last episode for story mode, and probably the probably the uh, the end of Hogwarts Legacy. Got done everything else. Side side quest stuff. Troll? Okay, no problem. Ready, and a bunch of Dabra. I am so glad I picked that up. We shouldn't be out here to see you, Sean. this. <laughs> Professor Weasley for the save. Let's end this. Let's get rid of Ragnarok and the rest of his gang. Let me guess. Abada Kedavra don't work on these things. Those creatures I was battling, those are uh, rock roughs. Minions. Just followers of the dark wizard of the game. Here it is. This is where I get to make my choice to be a dark wizard or a light wizard. We made it. I'm relieved we got here before Ranrock. I can't believe this is it. The repository has been under the castle for hundreds of years. Think of all the pain that created it. This is what Miriam, George, your friend Lodgok, and countless others died for. Miriam believed this forgotten magic could be used for such good. But she did not know the risks. She did not see what the Keepers have shown you. What Isadora showed yeah. you. You are now the Keeper of whatever power it holds. What do you intend to do with it? Here, here, uh, here's where I get to choose. Contain it here and protect it and get the good ending. 
or open up the book and say the power is mine. This is where you get to choose between a good ending or a bad ending. I plan to leave the repository as it is. I'm pleased to hear that. I've been thinking. What is it, Professor? I spent all year trying to keep our journey a secret from everyone, including Professor Weasley. But now I wonder if I should have shared it with her and the others sooner. Trusted them more. The Keepers wanted this secret to be locked away forever. How long will you keep it? The Keepers were right. The risk of using this magic is too dangerous. It is my responsibility alone to keep it safe. I understand, but you are not entirely alone. I will do all I can to help you. If I chose to, to say it's mine, then my eyes will turn turn red, and I, and I will turn evil. Goblins built this repository. It belongs to There's a final us. boss. Enough, Ranrock. It was never yours. I've been wanting to play with this. Miriam's wand. If she'd simply handed over the container. All of this could have been avoided. Foolish, self-important witch. <laughs> Seems you were two of a kind. She didn't know when to give up either. <laughs> Here comes the final boss. And that's it, the boss. I can't just cheese it. Absorbed the dark. He, he absorbed the evil powers and became a dragon. Okay. Uh. My killing pill. My curses ain't gonna do jack. So. Uh. How am I what how am I gonna do this? Um Get rid of Abada Kadabra, that's gonna be completely useless. Uh I don't know. I Man, let's just do something. Because they, they're not going to let me cheese it. I know that for a fact. Come on, come on, give me, give me a triangle, give me a triangle. Ah, 
boss, you're fighting nothing. Throw some cabbage at it. Talking about Sempra Sempra, I don't have that power. Probably won't even let me use these. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. If it's if it's let me use Incursio, will it let me cheese it? Will it let me cheese it? Dang it! Either I missed or he's immune to it. Easy. 
Bionic and Abra is useless. Uh... to be purple.
Use our full power. Save the world, but I couldn't save my mentor. My mentor died. Professor Eleazar Fig. I dare say he was a beloved professor to many of you, certainly a long-standing colleague to his peers. A famed adventurer and seeker of knowledge, he built a reputation charging into the unknown, brazenly disregarding both discretion and safety, providing perhaps a rather unfortunate lesson for us all. His devotion to adventure was rivaled only by his dedication to Hogwarts. And of course, to his wife, Mary, uh, Midi, um, whom we lost much too soon as well. Professor Fig represented the best of all of us. Oh, he could be deviously clever, possessed a brilliantly inquisitive mind, and was the most loyal of friends. But perhaps it was his remarkable courage for which we will all be forever indebted to him. If not for Professor Fig. Well, I can say with confidence that if not for him, many of us, let alone Hogwarts, would not be here today. Those that knew him best will agree that we must now honor him as only Hogwarts can, by wisely, resourcefully, Justly and bravely facing all that lies ahead. <clears throat> to Professor Fig! I believe we lost Fig. I didn't know him as well as you did. 
but I know he was a good man. Brad Weasley spoke for him. She honored him well. They will be well remembered. I realize the same should be done for my uncle. I hope Anne agrees to see me. Sebastian, I can't imagine what you and Anne are going through. Perhaps you'll hear from her soon. I hope so. I... I'll let you know. Sebastian, there's something you should know. It's to do with Victor Rookwood. I heard a rumor that he confronted you outside of Ollivander's. Sounds as if he faced quite a fight. The rumors are true, and I did. But it's not that. Just before Rookwood attacked, he uttered something familiar. The same words Anne heard before she was cursed. Children should be seen and not heard. Wait! What... what are you saying? It wasn't one of Ranrock's loyalists who cursed Anne. It was Rookwood. It was Rookwood all along. This... this can't be. It was the loyalists. It's always been them. The night Anne was cursed, all she saw were goblins. Once Rookwood allied with Ranrock, Isadora's estate became of interest to them both. That's why Rookwood was there the night Anne was cursed. He was working with Ranrock. When he saw your sister, well, he didn't want anyone to know. So he cursed her. And she's never been the same. So cruel. Rookwood deserved what he got. Thank you for telling me. It wasn't a goblin. I suppose I owe you an apology. All this time I thought goblins were the enemy. But it was never that simple. As for what happened in the catacomb, I've not stopped thinking about it. Perhaps we could meet soon. There's much I wish to say. Oh, I still have side quests with her. If I want, if I want to.
Well, we completed Hogwarts Legacy. Professor Weasley, you wanted to see me? I did. We haven't had a chance to speak since... I know you were quite close with Professor Fig. Hogwarts won't be the same without him. No, it won't. But I can assure you that he would want us to press on. And that he would rest easy knowing that the future of the wizarding world is in hands like yours. Thank you, Professor. You've had quite a year, both inside and outside of Hogwarts. I've heard all sorts of rumors. You've ridden a raphorn, befriended a goblin, rescued hippogriffs, even somehow ingratiated yourself with the headless hunt. How did you... It's harder to keep secrets around here than one might suspect. I'm just glad you found such a good friend in Miss Onai. I think her mother shares the sentiment. While I do not condone taking matters into your own hands when it comes to men like Rookwood and Harlow, your bravery is to be commended. Thank you, Professor. I... No need to discuss it further. What I would like to discuss is your wizard's field guide. May I see it? Of course. What's that? I don't have many side quests. It's mostly just little things. What do you think, Professor? I think you've been busy this year. I see some progress here, but quite a bit of your field guide has yet to be completed. Fortunately, you do have some time to prepare for your OWLs. I will confess, I had a sense about you from that first moment you came bursting in, late, to the sorting ceremony. I am pleased to see that my instincts were correct. To think you've only been with us a year and you'll already be taking your OWLs, well, it's nothing short of astonishing. Thank you, Professor, for everything. You are most welcome. I look forward to seeing what you do during the rest of your time with us. level 34 to get the true ending which is uh, go to the Great Hall and attend my attend my year uh, I'm really under leveled And I got tons of side quests, but these are just little, little things.
But I pretty much beat in the game. All it is, all it is, when you complete an OWL, it's you get. All it is is they they just celebrate, celebrate you beating the game. It's that's all it is. It's nothing that exciting. I could do it, or I could just stop, or I could just uh, end the game here, which is what I'll probably do because it'll take me forever to get to 35. So yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna stop here, and then I'll work on my next next thing. Um, I could either do my I could either for next time I could either start the Final Fantasy VII max level run, or I can do um, or I can do uh. Final Fantasy 15 Pocket Edition. I have that too. I also have uh, Final Fantasy Theater. Theater that I could also do. Or Catherine. That should be fun. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, have you guys like this uh, finale of, of Hogwarts Legacy and I will see you on my next quest. This is Kill You 288 signing off. Have a good day.